well with a specialized website or through the library website or Scopus or Web of Science, they have already filtered the research, um, the results for you. And so through keywords, you usually get, you find what you need and what is reliable, like reliable sources rather than more general sources. We can help them to discern between what is good information and what probably isn't information that they would want to use in an academic report. So we're here to, to tell them about the databases that we pay a lot of money for, uh, which it, it does boil down to you get what you pay for in this uh, a lot of the time. And we pay a lot of money for these databases which give scholarly content to the students. It's really important to get trained on how to use the library's databases. I actually did a database um, and like a note course with library in my undergrad. That course at the library gave me everything I needed to, do, to use not just the library database, but also other databases as well. Um, I tend to go directly to the databases, so through um, the database listings on the library homepage, uh, in through research tools and techniques, I think it is, and then into the databases, run my searches in that, and um, pull them down onto my computer. I spoke to a student, a PhD student, who had completed her degree elsewhere in the world, it wasn't in Australia, and I was introducing her to the databases that we had and showing her how to find this information. And She looked a bit quizzical and said, I've always just used Google. And she, by the time we had finished, she had realized that she'd wasted a lot of time. Because you can save a lot of time using the databases that we have rather than using Google. Because at Google, Nobody's looked at that information, it's just sitting there, not really coming at you in, in the correct order. But if you learn how to use what we have, then you don't have to recheck and check your sources, because the sources have been checked by somebody. Just knowing how to use, how to best use each database um, like individually, they don't all work the same, and little tricks and tips to get the, the most out of your search results as well. It was really useful, because it's stuff that you... you Kind of can't really figure out for yourself, you know what I mean? So they know all the tips and tricks and they can tell you how to how to work it.